Hi guys, it's me here. Um, packing for a, well, just a weekend trip. Uh, doing like an off-road exercise across Salisbury Plain with the armed forces. Um, Svengali is coming as well. That was his idea actually. And we're, um, well, this is my packing. This is what I'm taking. If I've missed anything, please point it out in the comments and I'll be, be much appreciated. But yeah, so here's the bike, my KTM, which you've all seen before. And this will be covered over by what I've got here. I've got a ground sheet, sleeping bag, one man tent, first aid kit. Yeah, we have to have a first aider in our team. We'll take water, we'll get, which will get stuffed in here. And we've got to take um, compasses and all that sort of stuff, which I'm making a bit of a list now to make sure I've not missed anything. And other stuff I'm taking. Right, well, what, what's happening is you, you, the whole point of the exercise is there's uh, 200 waypoints or something like that, which you've got to find um, using, you're allowed to use GPS or anything like that. It's a competition, there's only about 200 riders entering. Um, you're covering 253 miles off road. and the idea of the competition is to, the challenge is to get to as many points as possible and then mark them off or whatever you've got to do. I've never done anything like this before. Yeah, it starts at some silly time Saturday morning, silly, uh, it's like 7 a.m., 6 a.m. or something like that, and then it goes through to Sunday lunchtime. So you've got to be prepared to camp out and got to be prepared to not be able to get back to the, there's a base camp for Saturday evening where they're going to do a bit of a, cook up and stuff like that but you've got to have enough equipment with you in case you don't make it there so I've got, got my camping gear which I'll need anyway and then with me I'm taking I've got my cooking pots a few torches this is a map case got all the tools I need for the KTM which isn't too many, it's just for the wheel nuts, the uh, chain adjustment, um, cutters, screwdrivers, and a little multi tool as well. Stove. Pov, obviously, because that's going to be running all the time. Okay, it drives Velcro and that sort of stuff. I'm going to chuck this in my rucksack, which is, I think might be handy. We did have Doug coming with us as well, but um, he's pulled out because he's doing his law degree. And I know. Fuck all about engines. I don't think Sven does either. So we're going to take this with us. So we've got another guy, Glenn, coming with us who you'd have, you'd have seen in Sven's videos. Just in case we don't get to the base, I've got myself a chicken casserole and a chocolate pudding with chocolate sauce. Now I like my puddings. Top. Gloves. Body protector, which is just essential. Knee pads. Druzies. And these are my homemade specialities. We have we'll force field legs, leggings, which have gold armour in them, and I cut them into shorts. They're not my pants, they're my pants, and they've got all the protection on the, for the bottom of the spine, for the sides, all the way around, for the crutch and everything. My hat, obviously, need that. Goggles, which are there. My tooty booties. Um, I think there's only about 10% civilians taking part in it and it is as I say it's 253 miles but it's all off-road through rivers up hills um, through mud shit and dirt and yeah it should be it should be pretty good should make a good series um, if you're not subscribed make sure you subscribe to watch the series obviously and um, you know, hope you like it hope you enjoy it but yeah so um, hopefully you'll see the videos soon. I hope you've hopefully you enjoy them. Yeah, should be good. Should be good fun. Hope you enjoy it.